So, I mentioned that I am uh, building the M5 or the 5mm titanium and that I changed the rod ends. So, how do I do that? Well, the, the metric, the size of M5 is M5 by 0 0.8. So, the correct diameter of the hole to open to M5 is uh, 5 millimeters minus 0 0.8 so that's 4.2 so what I have here is a 4.2 millimeters bit so what I will do I will put it here on the vise and then simply with the rod end by hand I will open a little bit of it and with the help of one of these so I don't want to go too deep like to I want to cut all how to explain this I want to cut all the excess plastic but at the same time I don't want it to uh, then go too much so yes I hope you guys can see so I'm rotating this rotating this like so and then I will rotate it at the same height so I don't leave the rod end to go inside and I check do I have to cut a little bit more yes I have to cut a little bit more so back because the 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 bit is quite sharp so if I just continue threading I will just cut all the rod end and that's not what I want that's why I hold it in place and I rotate it again not saying this is the best method but was the one that I found that made sense to me and I went with it so. yeah so this is about it Oh yeah, and this being titanium, I'm not so concerned of damaging the titanium, and this is really tough material. So, I will look about how the thread is. So, it is more or less like so. Anyway, final tweak. So, this will still be very hard to, to start. I will cut just a little bit and make like a little small chamfer. So the rod end will suffer quite a bit because you know it's not really built for this. And it will twist. But seems to be also very sturdy and very solid setup but time will tell so the rod end still moves free that's good and now I have to start checking out where I need to stop so if this is like this almost So this is how I'm making them. After the threads, open the rod end to 4.2 millimeters, thread it on the M5, that's it. So as you have seen me struggle with um, putting the rod end on the link now you will really see me struggle cutting the thread on this um, on this titanium uh, you've seen me on the grinder I tried to put a little bit of a chamfer or quite a bit of a chamfer 
especially in the beginning here not so much actually this so far ah, I cannot use this one um, we shouldn't be too far off of five millimeters here so yeah let's uh, go to it let's see how this goes so I always put a little bit of this and I use the WD-40 supposed to be cutting oil it's the only thing kind of commercially available not very not industrial this is easy to get anywhere almost um, so this is what I use and I try to use especially for this plenty of oil and try to go slowly who would have thought that with a good quality die this would be so much easier who would have thought now we don't have much of the chamfer so it's starting to get a bit harder <laughs> 